If you're gonna be a princess, you gotta dress the part. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 iconic Disney princess outfits. Make it pink. Now hide, quick! For this list, we'll be looking at some dreamy Disney princess clothes. Whether it's those lovely outfits that were created through wondrous magic, or clothes that the princesses started out in. Because hey, sometimes they wake up like this. We'll only be covering the ladies in the official lineup. So as fierce as women like Megara are, especially with that dress, they won't be on this list. Well, thanks for everything, Herc. It's been a real slice. Number 10, Anna's winter outfit, Frozen. For now, um, how about boots? Winter boots and dresses? That would be in our winter department. If our winter clothes looked as cute as Anna's, we probably wouldn't mind going out and building a snowman or two. Do you want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. Go away, Anna. At first glance, Anna's clothes look simple enough. Skirt, cloak, and boots that are very much necessary for winter, or taking on large snow creatures. However, it's the fun, bright colors and the small details that make this outfit a favorite of ours. Elsa may be the more sophisticated sister, but with the elegant designs in the skirt, the details in the black top and pink cloak, Anna certainly has her own sense of grace and style. The only frozen heart around here is yours. <laughs> Number 9, Pocahontas's dress, Pocahontas. Just around the river. When you're one with nature, you apparently get an amazing outfit so you can paint with all the colors of the wind. Can you paint with all the colors of the wind? Can you paint with all the colors of the wind? It doesn't even matter that it's just one ensemble. Not when you rock it the way Pocahontas does. Her outfit of choice consists of a one-shoulder tan dress with a bright blue necklace. Hey, what can we say? When you're a free spirit who runs headfirst into adventure, less is more. No! Not that way! That and you don't need complexity when you have perfect wind-whipping hair and killer cheekbones. Besides, she tried complex once. It didn't go so well. Wait till he sees you there in your curls. John's always had such a fondness for girls with curls. Number 8. Tiana's Green Ball Gown, The Princess and the Frog. Like I told y'all, kissing a princess breaks the spell. If we could, we'd put this girl's entire wardrobe into our closet, even her work uniform. Maybe it's because the story takes place in the Big Easy, but every outfit Tiana wears really lights up the screen. Especially that lovely ball gown. Sticking with the whole frog motif, this dress is absolutely heavenly with its layers of leaf green, matching crown, and elbow length gloves. You just kissed yourself a princess. And. I'm about to do it again. With just the right amount of jewelry and her hair tied up in a neat bun, this princess makes frog transformations in Bayou Navigation look good. Forget being almost there, Tiana has arrived. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Number 7, Elsa's Ice Queen dress, Frozen. Let it go. The song did say let it go, and Elsa did exactly that. It should be noted that her outfit before this transformation is pretty spectacular with its regal elegance, but this ice blue dress won us over as soon as we laid eyes on it. Whoa, Elsa, you look different. It's a good different. It's a stunning light blue gown with a sheer cape behind it, complete with speckled details of snowflakes and frost. Also, we have to say her I'm done with this nonsense smile compliments the dress well. Now if only we could make ourselves a fancy dress whenever we were fed up with people. The cold never bothered me anyway. Number 6, Jasmine's sea green outfit, Aladdin. In 
Aladdin wasn't the only one smitten by Agrabah's princess. I'm really very sorry. Wow. Jasmine's beauty is undeniable. Heck, she can even make a plain brown cloak look good. Decades later and we're still in love with that short top, those hair and pants, that perfect shade of green, and did you see those earrings and shoes? We also love the bold red of the alternate version of this ensemble. Unfortunately, she's wearing it against her will. I never realized how incredibly handsome you are. Hmm, that's better. Still, she manages to make the best of a bad situation. Remember, Jafar, I am not a prize to be won! Number 5. Aurora's Pink Blue Dress, Sleeping Beauty Which dress is better, pink or blue? Answer, we're picking both. After all, how could we possibly choose between the two when Aurora's own fairy godmothers can't decide? We can all agree that the style of the dress is simply sublime. The way it's cut, the way it flows, all of that is nailed perfectly. But then we get not one, but two color choices. This would be easier if Aurora didn't look so stunning in both colors. That playful pink, that gorgeous blue, hey, maybe we can mash the two together. Hmm, on second thought. No. Now look what you've done. Number four, Ariel's mermaid outfit, The Little Mermaid. Have you ever seen anything so wonderful in your entire life? Wow, cool. But, uh, what is it? What does one wear when she's a mermaid princess who lives under the sea? Under the sea. Under the sea. Nobody beat us, fry us, and eat us in frequency. Especially when she has a full head of luscious red hair and a tail. Hey, mermaid tails are always in style. Flip in your fins, you don't get too far. Legs are required for jumping, dancing, strolling along down a... What's that word again? Street. While Ariel's purple seashell top doesn't seem like much of an outfit, it is iconic to her. And it's the most fun piece she has in her wardrobe. We admit we also have a soft spot for that big pink dress. Especially when she uses the dingle hopper, sorry, fork, as a comb. But when it comes to Ariel, we had to stick to our oceanic roots. Watch and you'll see. Someday I'll be part of you. Number three, Belle's golden ball gown, Beauty and the Beast. Your lady awaits. <laughs> she may not be like the rest of us, but when you illuminate a room just by stepping into it, you don't have to be. Belle was seen as an oddity in her town, right down to that cute blue dress of hers. Look, there she goes, that girl is strange, no question. <laughs> but when she enters the Beast's castle, she gets a major dress upgrade. The romantic dance she shares with the Beast is where we really fall in love with all those golden layers. Bittersweet and strange, finding you can change, learning you were wrong. We're eager to see Emma Watson bring that iconic dress to the big screen. After all, it is a tale as old as time. Tale as old as time, song as old as rhyme, beauty and the Beast. Number 2, Snow White's Dress, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. With a smile and a song. Ladies and gentlemen, the very first Disney princess. Armed with optimism and rosy cheeks, we whistled along with her while she worked that classic dress. A young woman as cheerful as Snow was born to wear bright colors. And bright is exactly what we got complete with some clever red accents to go with the bow in her hair. To us, Snow White's dress is a surprisingly bold choice, since she wears it outside with all of those woodland creatures. When you smile and you sing, everything you can do and you bring the light of the world. Kudos
kudos to you, fair maiden, but we'd have all kinds of outdoor scuffs in that outfit. Before we get to our number one pick, let's dig in our dream closets and pull out these honorable mentions. Who are you? And how did you find me? Aha. Uh -huh. Beads of jade for beauty. You must proudly show it. My whole life is planned out. Preparing for the day I become, well, my mother. She's in charge of every single day of my life. Number one, Cinderella's ball gown. Cinderella. Oh, it's a beautiful dress. Did you ever see such a beautiful dress? Ah, uh, so this is what dreams look like. In dress form, anyway. This is the dress that made us believe that fairy tales come true. Just as Cinderella is ready to cry herself to sleep after dealing with her horrible stepfamily, she meets her fairy godmother, a woman we could all use every now and then. Something simple, but daring too. Oh, just leave it to me, what a gown this will be. All it takes is some good old-fashioned bibbidi-bobbidi-boo to create this absolutely dreamy gown. And every single iteration we've seen of it is heavenly. The only downside is that it only lasts until midnight. But that's just enough time to snag a prince. So this is love. We'll happily take some of those glass slippers, though. And look, glass slippers. Do you agree with our list? I'll be all right. I'm a big tough girl. Which Disney princess dress do you wish were part of your wardrobe? Let's hear all about it. For more magical top tens published every day, be sure to wish upon a star or just subscribe to Ms. Mojo. Yeah.